Hi and welcome back to the channel. Today's video will show you how to create a simple timer in Unreal Engine 5. So let's start. We are in a third person template and the first thing we want to do is to create user widgets. So right click over here, go to user interface and click widget blueprint and choose user widget, click select. This will be a widget that displays time. So you can type in time, time widget. So double click to open it up and we want to make some simple UI. So canvas panel, click it and add some text over here. We will display our uh, timer. You can select your text box and uh, go over here under the font and change size for, uh, for example, to be 100. And move it here, for example, if you wish, you can center it inside your uh, block. To be able to control this text block, we need to change this to be a variable. Don't worry, just click is variable and change variable to be time variable and hit compile, save it and go over here on the top right corner. You can switch to graph editing mode. And first of all, we want to add our custom event. This will be our timer. Uh, we need a new variable. So we go over here under the variables, click plus button. And this will be our time variable and make sure it's float. And now drag and drop it here and click this get variable. So we need to connect this time to uh, Unreal Engine's Delta seconds. So uh, we can have some time so we can calculate time. So get world Delta seconds. And to connect them, drag here, type in plus, click add and connect it here. This will get the time from our game. After that, we need to set this time. So just drag this variable and click set time and connect this. So this will, this will check this over here. We'll check the delta seconds of our game and set it uh, every time in our set variable. But we need to display things on our uh, UI. So we will drag and drop and use this time seconds to string. So we can convert the seconds that are built in Unreal Engine and convert them into something readable for the user. And we want to display it in our text block that we created here. So drag and drop this text block and click get and type in set text. and connect this with this. And you can see it says convert string to text. So it's okay because we are converting the string variable into our text that uh, will be uh, visible on our uh, UI and connect it here, hit compile. Everything works fine. And we now need to call this functionality and we will do this in the event tick. So every time the game ticks, every time the second passes, it will call this whole timer thing. So just drag and type in timer. With this, we will call this whole function over here, which is called timer. This is why we are uh, typing here timer. So hit compile. If you click play, nothing will happen, nothing will display because we don't have our uh, hood. So to have our heads up display time widget, we can we can't drag it here, because this is just a widget, we need to incorporate this widget into our heads up display. And to do that, we will right click, go blueprint class, type in hood, and select this one, click select, and hood, like this, control, save everything, open my HUD, and go over here in the event graph, over here under the event begin play, we need to display our widget. So we'll go over here, drag and drop and type in create widget. And this will create our widget, this one time widget on our screen, but we need to select it, of course. So select time widget. So we want to create time widget when we click play, it will create our time widget, it will display it on our screen. The UI is a bit clunky in Unreal Engine, but don't worry. So we can just type in add to viewport and connect the return value, hit compile, everything is good. But if we click play, still nothing happens. To fix this, we need to go to the world settings. So we're here under the settings, make sure that you can see the world settings. 
and select the world settings and under the selected game mode we need to change this default HUD into my HUD. Like this we can save, we can hit play and we have our timer here. And this is it, if you find this helpful let me know in the comments below, drop some likes and subscribe for a new content every week. Uh, until then uh, have a nice day and see you in some other video, bye bye.